In this video, I'll be showing you 10 super cute outfits that you can easily put together when you have nothing to wear this summer. This is the first outfit of the video. It's very Emma Chamberlain if you have seen her video about what she's wearing for summer. Something you could just throw on when you're like going anywhere. And honestly, I love it. This is a really simple outfit, something you could just throw on to go anywhere and it will work perfectly. Accessorizing it is really important. Maybe you could pull off wearing just the tank top and the shorts and nothing else, but for me, I think this outfit could really use some accessorizing. So that's why I added this tote bag, these sunglasses. I also put on some jewelry. So yeah, that was outfit one. Waking up feeling like it's going away. So this is the second outfit. It's literally the same as the other one with the same shorts, and accessories except for the bag and the top. So basically, the point I'm trying to make in this outfit is how you can take that outfit where it was just this plain white tank and then these, I don't know what you call these shorts, but you could take that and then spice it up with a colorful tank or like a tank where it has like patterns and like pictures and graphics on it and then you can spice it up more with like a pattern bag and of course I have to add these sunglasses because they just add something to every single outfit and it just makes it like 10 times better if I were to actually wear this outfit I would take off this second necklace and just keep this one since it's like pretty bold already and you can see it better in this outfit than in the other one I don't really know if these fluffy bags are in anymore I bought this last summer when it was super trendy I use this every now and then I still think it's kind of cute don't come at me if you don't okay so this is outfit three so i really couldn't decide whether i wanted sunglasses or not because i've been using sunglasses in the other two outfits but this is like a different hair i mean it looks too so this would be one version of the outfit where i would have these sunglasses and i have this shirt it's thrifted I just cut it. Okay, I know it looks bad, but yeah, and then I got this skirt from a style bundle. It doesn't have a tag or anything. I didn't know if I wanted to wear this bag with it because like that's a lot of black, 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 black. If only I had like a white or a blue bag, then it would have been better, but for now, we're just going to be using this black bag. But yeah, this is the third outfit. Very simple. <laughs> Here is the fourth outfit. I don't really know how I feel about this outfit. I feel like it's just my hair is kind of weird. I'll probably wear this going to like a picnic or something. Something really like chill. I have this green dress from PacSun and then this bag from Urban. These sunglasses are my sister's. I have no idea where she got these, but this is just a very simple outfit. This is the fifth outfit. This is what I was talking about for the last outfit where you wrap a cardigan or it can be any sweater, but I don't know. I think it looks best when you use cardigans, but you use a cardigan to tie it around your body. I'll show you how to do it right now. Get the cardigan, you kind of like flip the collar part inwards and then I kind of just like throw it on top of me and then I make it diagonal. Then I kind of like to adjust where the tie is. So I personally don't like the tie being that low or that loose either. So I will kind of like pull and stuff at the tie until it's, you know, I think that's fine. I think this sleeve is a little too long, but it's okay. Okay, I think this is good for me and that's how you do it. So what I said earlier, when you like add a cardigan on top of it, like tied like this, I feel like it adds so much more spice to the outfit and it just makes it look so much cuter. And I'm just wearing these khakis from, I think Urban, I forgot. I got this corset top from YesStyle. I got this cardigan from Brandy. So yeah, that was the fifth outfit. We are past the halfway point of the outfits. One, two, three. Fuck it up, ah, fuck it up, ah, fuck it up, ah, fuck it up. Ah.
I don't know what that was. <laughs> Yep. So here's the sixth outfit. I already wore this um, outfit combo except for the jeans. The jeans were different. But I already wore this outfit combo for my birthday. It's on my Instagram. Shameless plug of my Instagram. Go follow me on Instagram. This would be an outfit I wear anywhere. Except the only con is if it's gonna be really hot, then you might not want to wear this because there is a skin tight tank top under this. I layered a tank top under this vest since I think this vest is a little weird. So you might feel a little bit hot, but I honestly don't really care about that. That would be the only downside to wearing this outfit. But other than that, I think this is such a cute outfit. You got the sunglasses again because what outfit doesn't need sunglasses? It's just a cute little vest moment. But yeah, this is a really cute, simple uh, outfit that you can just put together and you just got some plain jeans. I got the vest from Zara. I got the tank top from Urban Outfitters. I got these jeans from YesStyle and yeah. Some of you guys might be thinking that this is like a basic outfit. This is like something I have actually never tried before. Honestly, this is cute. It might be plain, but it's cute. This is definitely something I would wear to the beach. I mean, where else could you see me going with this outfit? This outfit is so summery. I am so excited for summer. It just makes me so excited for summer, you know? So, these sunglasses, the same as always. My sisters got this tank at the same tank. This flannel was thrifted. These shorts I've had for literally four years. I use it every summer, I reuse them because they're my favorite. My obsession with high-waisted pants, bottoms, anything, like it's never gonna end. I don't really know how I feel about the ends though. And then I thrifted this bag. And yeah, everything else you have seen previously in this video. This was outfit seven. I kind of wore an outfit like this, just with different jeans on my Instagram a few weeks ago, but I like honestly really love the combination of all the colors. They're all like pastel and like the bag just goes so well with it too. And I just love the color scheme. So there's white on white. But I decided to even it out with adding this cardigan again to add some color, you know, to even out the white on white. And I also added this to add more color. This corset top is from Kiss the Rainbow. These wide leg white high waisted jeans are from Intermix. This bag again is from Urban. This is from Brandy again. Yeah, this is like literally such an easy outfit to put together. It's so cute. I literally am so obsessed with it. on my Instagram again but it's because it's cute anyways so I just have this really cute crop vest with these colorful pants y'all when I tell you you need to buy colorful pants you need to buy them because they spice up an outfit so much like literally you could just wear a plain top and it would still look good if you wore it with these colorful pants because the pants adds color and spice to the outfit. Yeah. I got this vest from YesStyle. These from, I think, Urban Outfitters. And I got this bag from Gucci. So yeah, it's a really simple outfit and I'm just wearing like a simple necklace with it. But I think the pattern and the matching colors really pulls it together, even if it's simple. Final outfit number 10. We are back at the shorts. So, like, I know this is supposed to be summer outfits, but I'm wearing like an oversized sweater. There are just some days where it's kind of cold. Yeah, like maybe if you're like going to the supermarket in the morning and it's kind of cold still. So yeah, like this is just like something you could layer with, you know? But, I think not. But this is what I would wear normally without that. It is a halter top. This is like a different version of the first outfit, but just with a halter top. It's like such an easy combo to put together. It's so cute. Tote bag. Even out the bagginess of the shorts with this. This is the final outfit number 10. 
Okay guys, that was the last outfit. If you can hear my dogs barking, I'm sorry about that. Please like, comment, subscribe. If you get to this point of the video, please comment which one was your favorite outfit. I genuinely wanna know. This was actually so fun. I can't wait till summer, like actually. It's so exciting, so many new opportunities for outfits and new trends. I literally am in love with the trends right now. They're so cute. Yeah. That's it for this video. Like, comment, and subscribe for more fashion videos and lifestyle videos like this. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.